Namaste. So I'm Mark Darby, and this is Helen. Hi. We're going to be working together, um, talking about yoga, uh, particularly the Ashtanga yoga practice. Um, but whatever yoga practice you're doing, the information we're giving will help any yoga practice. And Helen's also going to be talking about Chinese medicine, meridians, um, and we're combining both in our teachings. We work with both angles. Hi, I'm Helen. I'm very happy to be here and uh, make a video on our channel with my dear teacher, Mark Darby. Our channel will focus on the yoga and the health. We talk about the traditional way to practice yoga and the natural way to maintain health. Hope you like it. Okay. So, um, just a little history of where I came from. Uh, my first yoga teacher was Patabi Joyce. I was very blessed in my travels. Uh, I was searching for a teacher. And uh, this particular time I came to Mysore and I said to myself, now I'm ready to practice yoga. So it didn't happen until I actually accepted the fact that I was going to be ready to practice. And I didn't know anybody, but I just happened to meet somebody, uh, Cliff Barber. Uh, we called him Old Cliff because he was like 48 years old or something. Um, and he introduced me. He said, come and meet my teacher. It was Patabi Joyce. And um, basically I accepted to practice with him. I spent the next f five years, four of the next five years, under his care, practice with him. Uh, my wife arrived one week later and we stayed together. Um, we weren't man and wife at that stage, mind you. We were just became friends when we married. Afterwards had children. But in that period of four out of five years, we stayed with Patabi Joyce. And so that was my beginnings of the Shtanga Yoga. So it was a very deep, intense uh, time. I cannot re ever regret it. What I learned there has changed my life. Um, my whole, yeah, everything I do in life is revolving from that time, that period of my life where things changed. And it's been wonderful. You know, I can never regret it. As I said, I can never regret that. But I'm still learning. I haven't stopped there that five years. I didn't learn anything. I'm still learning and learning and learning. I'm learning as I teach. So um, I started to teach. I was blessed by Pataba Joyce to teach. I was a terrible teacher. It took me years to learn. And, but that's what I'm dedicating my life to now is um, understanding yoga, understanding anatomy, and understanding the connective tissue in the body and learning how to teach it. And luckily I have students like Helen um, who encourage me. And Helen came from a different background, see. So. Yeah, I have practiced long time for yoga, but I start my Ashtanga yoga with Darby. He is amazing, wonderful teacher. So all the students love him. <laughs> And then she got into traditional Chinese medicine, yeah, yeah, yeah. acupuncture. Yeah. And um, so we work together uh, as an exchange. I come and give Helen yoga classes, and she sticks needles in me. <laughs> okay. Okay, body, more energies. Oh, very good. So I'm very happy with her knowledge. I'm her guinea pig, and, as she's my guinea pig. So hope you enjoy our, the sessions with us. The instruction we're going to give um, on postures on the connective tissue. Thank you very much. Thank you.